Five dead in Israel as Hezbollah fires projectiles from Lebanon, report. The attack came ahead of expected meetings in Israel between top officials and U.S. envoys engaged in a new push for a ceasefire in both Lebanon, where Israeli forces are battling Iran-backed Hezbollah, and in Gaza, where they are fighting Hamas Palestinian militants. Israel-Hezbollah war. Smoke billows on the Israel side of the border with Lebanon in northern Israel on October 31, 2024. Subscribe to notifications. U.S. envoys push for a ceasefire in both Lebanon and Gaza. A Hezbollah attack on the northern Israeli border community of Metula killed five people, including an Israeli farmer and four foreign workers. Separately, Israel issued an evacuation warning to residents of Baalbek in eastern Lebanon for a second consecutive day. On Wednesday, it conducted heavy airstrikes targeting Hezbollah in the city, which is famed for its Roman temples. Hezbollah said it had launched several rocket and artillery attacks against Israeli forces near the southern town of Qiyam on Thursday. It marked the fourth straight day of fighting in and around the strategic hilltop town, which is home to one of the largest Shiite communities in southern Lebanon. Hezbollah aims to keep Israeli forces out of the town to prevent them detonating homes and buildings, as has happened on a large scale in other border towns, a source familiar with the group's thinking told Reuters. Hezbollah says its fighters have prevented Israel from fully occupying or controlling any southern villages, while Israel says it is carrying out limited ground operations aimed at destroying the group's infrastructure. The attack came ahead of expected meetings in Israel between top officials and U.S. envoys engaged in a new push for a ceasefire in both Lebanon, where Israeli forces are battling Iran-backed Hezbollah, and in Gaza, where they are fighting Hamas Palestinian militants.